Pregame.com. This is Brett Bowers of Pregame.com Studios just off the Vegas Strip. We're counting down my top 25 power rated teams entering the 2017 college football season. In this particular video, we're going to go over my number 16 rated team. It's the Oklahoma State Cowboys, a team that won 10 games a year ago. This is a team that returns 12 starters from last year, seven on offense, five on de defense. And i got to be honest with you guys, I'm a little indifferent on Oklahoma State this year. Not as high on them as some other preseason publications. You might flip open one of those preseason magazines and see Oklahoma State in the top 10. And I even think they're in the top five in one of them. I got them at number 16. But one area where I am buying this Oklahoma State team is on the offensive side of the ball, particularly at the skill position. There's only two teams in the entire country that return a 3,000-yard passer, a 1,000-yard rusher, and a 1,000-yard receiver. And Oklahoma State is one of those two teams. Let's talk about their quarterback, Mason Rudolph. Off. Last year threw for more than 4,000 yards. He had 28 touchdowns. Four interceptions is all. And when it's all said and done, he will be the all-time career passing leader in Oklahoma State history. You look at the wide receiver spot, James Washington, a guy that had nearly 1,400 yards receiving last year. He might be a top five wide receiver in the country. And this Oklahoma State receiving unit might be the best in the entire country. Now, second reason why I'm not necessarily buying Oklahoma State this year comes on the defensive side of the ball, a defense that last year allowed 446 six yards per game. That was only number 92 in the entire country. This year's defense, very inexperienced. You look at percent of tackles returning. So if you count up all the tackles from last year and you take a percentage of what's coming back, Oklahoma State only ranks number 105 in the country in that category. So not such a great Oklahoma State defense last year, even more inexperienced this year. So my favorite bet for Oklahoma State when you add in that experienced offense, not so great defense, actually comes in a week seven match up for them. They host the Baylor Bears and I'm going to lay it and play it and take Oklahoma State minus seven. If you remember last year's game, very misleading. Oklahoma State probably should have pulled the outright upset on the road. I like the scheduling dynamics in this one. Oklahoma State minus seven, the pick, and we'll have more team previews and more videos at pregame.com.